In this video, we'll look at how we can count the number of different coloured cells in Excel. Unfortunately, Excel's COUNTIF function doesn't allow us to count by the cell fill, so a workaround is needed, but it's fairly simple and doesn't have to get too complicated at all. So uh, let's go ahead. Uh, the first thing we want to do is to be able to filter by cell colour. So uh, let's let's do that. Let's add a header row cell color, and uh, we want to make this uh, be able to be filtered. So let's go ahead, go ahead and add the uh, filter. Now, uh, first thing we want to do is filter by color, and uh, first we'll filter the yellow cells, and we will uh, assign them the number one. Uh, at the end. Next, we filter the uh, red color. So again, filter by color and go select the red ones and we'll call, we'll assign them the number two. Okay, so then we can release the uh, filter. So, so now you can see all the yellow cells have been assigned the number one all the red cells have been assigned the number two. Uh, and here we want to do the totaling and uh, I've gone ahead and labeled a yellow and a red. Maybe we'll put in the uh, Excel formula. So we're going to use the count if function equals count if and the range will be the entire range of uh, cells. The criteria will be uh, if it's the number one, we want to count the number of ones. And then, so we can see straight away, we have five yellows. And uh, now we want to do uh, the color red as well. So we can just go ahead, copy the formula. And uh, we want to do two. Uh, now, one quick, uh, Thing I noticed as I was doing the, uh, the formula is instead of specifying this range that I want to count, I should have specified the entire column. So let's go ahead and modify that. Okay, so now we can see that we are counting the entire column and we want to do the same. Okay, as you can see, we have five yellow cells. Is that correct? Yes, we have five yellow cells and we have four red cells. So this is a simple way we can count the number of uh, colored cells.